Hello dear friends, welcome back. It's me Srija Suraj and you are watching SS Math Solutions. In this section, we are going to discuss about the Gated Category 3 Mathematics Pedagogy questions. Okay, let's go to our sections. So here is our first question. So I will read the question firstly and options also. So that time I will give 2 to 3 seconds for answering. Okay, that time you just think about the answer. We can finally find out how many answers were correct from this pedagogy questions okay let's go to our section so here is our first question which among the following is most related to concept attainment model of teaching mathematics o options here are examples and non examples encounter with a problem yes or no questions puzzling situation so which among the following is most related to concept attainment model examples and non examples is the answer the option a examples and non examples is the answer moving to the next one programmed learning is based on field theory classical conditioning operand conditioning gestalt theory programmed learning is based on operand conditioning okay programmed learning is based on operand conditioning okay moving to the next one which of the for which of the following is an axiom the perpendicular from the center of a circle to a chord bisects a chord sum of the angles of a quadrilateral is 360 sum of the angles of a linear pair is supplementary the centroid of a triangle divides each median in the ratio 2 is to 1 so we need the example for an axiom hope you got the answer here option 3 sum of the angles of a linear pair is supplementary is the Example for axiom. Okay, some of the angles of a linear pair is supplementary. Here is our next question. The highest power of 2 contained in 10, 6, 7, 8 and 9. No need of time for this, right? The highest power of 2, 2, highest power we can use inside of this 10 is 2 cube. Okay, 2 cube 8. So, 8 is the highest power of 2 contained in 10. Let's try the next one. Which of the following is a characteristic of an instructional objective? Broad, theoretical, difficult to, to achieve immediate goal. So, here is the answer. Immediate goal. Okay. Option 4. Immediate goal is the answer. Which of the following is a characteristic of an instructional objective is immediate goal. Let's try the next one. Circle 2 pi r. Then regular hexagon is dash is an example of multiple choice question, completion type question, classification type questions, analog type question. It's an example for analog type questions. Okay, option four analog type question is the answer. Next question is here to prove 5 plus root 2 is rational. For students of class 9, we can use method of induction, method of deduction, method of contradiction, method of contrapositive to prove 5 plus root 2 is rational we can use the method method of contradiction okay method of contradiction we can use let's try the next one example of a mathematical skill is skill of reinforcement skill of interpreting graphs skill of set set induction skill of questioning example of a mathematical skill Obviously, we know that the skill of mathematics is skill of interpreting graphs. Okay, skill of interpreting graph is the answer here. Moving to the next one, the Roman numeral representing 753 is. 753 we can write it as 500 plus 100 plus 100. So, we will get 700. Then 53 is there. So, 50 plus 3. Like that we can separate it. Is right. So, for 500 how we denote for 500 is d then 200 were there that is cc for 50 l is there then three ones so the option three is the answer d c c l three one okay option c is the answer moving to the next one to enlarge or reduce graphs diagrams or pictures we can use angle mirror proportional divider slide rule transit so to enlarge or reduce graphs diagrams or pictures we can use proportional dividers answer is proportional dividers moving to the next one for introducing isosceles trapezium in class 8 the most appropriate prerequisite is quadrilateral trapezium parallelogram rectangle 
so for introducing isosceles trapezium the most appropriate prerequisite is rectangle okay so rectangle is the prerequisite most appropriate prerequisite to study or introduce isosceles trapezium let's move to the next one Purposiveness of an evaluation tool is referred as objectivity, reliability, validity, objective basedness. Purposiveness of an evaluation tool. Answer is validity. Okay, option 3, validity is the answer. Moving to the next one. The lowest level of learning according to Robert M. Gartney is concept learning, problem solving, verbal association, signal learning. So, the lowest level of learning according to Robert M. Gagney is signal learning. Okay, option 4, signal learning is the answer. Hope you understood this much. Moving to the next one. Which of the following is related to lecture method of teaching mathematics? The students remain active, give sense of satisfaction, imparts efficiency in problem solving, develop scientific attitude among students. So, the lecture method related to lecture method of teaching mathematics, the answer is gives sense of satisfaction. Gives sense of satisfaction is the answer. Okay, moving to the next one. The understanding of the world in which man lives refers to aesthetic value, national value, international value, cultural value. answer is cultural value okay the understanding of the world in which man lives it's obviously refers to cultural value moving to the next one which of the following is not a characteristic of evaluation not a characteristic of evaluation it reveals how much an individual performs it is a continuous process it caters to academic and non-academic subjects it helps in discovering the needs of an individual so, which of the following is not a characteristic of evaluation? Have you got the answer? So, here option A, it reveals how much an individual performs. Okay, it reveals how much an individual performs is not a characteristic of evaluation. Other three were the characteristics of evaluation. Okay, moving to the next one. Learning outcomes are mainly desirable changes in the content material, desirable changes in the learner behavior, desirable changes in the teaching strategies, desirable changes in the evaluation techniques. So, the learning outcomes are mainly desirable changes in the learner behavior. Okay, desirable changes in the learner behavior is the main outcome for learning. Okay, moving to next one. Teaching or learning process in mathematics will be more effective if the teacher selects higher level objectives, the teacher provides multi-level activities, the teacher prepares a lesson plan, the students actively participate in goal-oriented tasks. So, we know that we all were facing this problem, right? So, we know that the teaching or learning process in mathematics will be more effective when the students actively participate in goal oriented task. Okay? When the students are actively participating in our class, then the class section will be more effective. Right? Moving to the next one. Which of the following is not related to linear programmed instruction in mathematics? Remedial measures, small frames, immediate feedback, self learning materials. So, here which of the following is not related to linear programmed instruction in mathematics? Not related. So, here is our answer. Option A, remedial measures. Okay, remedial measures is the answer. Here is our next question. Which is the first step in the procedure for the problem solving method? Gathering data in a systematic manner, sensing the problem, formulating tentative solutions, defining and limiting the problem. So, first step in the problem solving method. So, we need to firstly identify or sensing the problem. Okay, sensing the problem is the first step in the problem solving method. Moving to the next one. Test designed to measure certain knowledge and skill as a result of instruction is achievement test, diagnostic test, prognostic test, personality test. 
so the test designed to measure certain knowledge and skill as a result of instruction is achievement test okay achievement test is the answer test designed to measure certain knowledge and skill as a result of instruction is achievement test moving to the next one the process of quantifying performance is measurement evaluation assessment testing the process of quantifying performance so the process of quantifying performance is measurement okay measurement is the answer let's try the next one the term syntax in the context of model of teaching means phases in the model pupils reaction teachers reaction instructional effects the term syntax hope you got the answer so answer is phases in the model phases in the model is the answer moving to the next one a student is creative in mathematics if he is talented in one or two field with an iq of 140 or above intelligent talented and productive thinker capable of performing psychomotor activities so we know that a student is creative in mathematics how we will call a student as creative he should be intelligent talented and productive thinker so option c is the answer intelligent talented and productive thinker moving to the next one the branch of mathematics which is a continuation of arithmetic is algebra coordinate geometry geometry trigonometry very easy question we know that the branch of mathematics it's a continuation of arithmetic is algebra okay algebra is the answer moving to the next one the specification recall and recognition come under affective domain psychomotor domain cognitive domain none of these specifications recall and recognition come under cognitive domain okay cognitive domain so specifications recall and recognition come under cognitive domain moving to the next one the mathematician who discovered the theory of irrational numbers ramanujan pythagoras madhava newton so who discovered the theory of irrational numbers we know that pythagoras is the answer so the mathematician pythagoras who discovered the theory of irrational numbers moving to the next one if each interior angle and exterior angle of a regular polygon are equal then it is a square rectangle equilateral triangle or regular hexagon so each interior angle and exterior angle of a regular polygon are equal then we can call it as say square okay square square is the answer so for the squares each interior angle and exterior angle of a regular polygon are equal then we can call it as a square moving to the next one the polygon with nine diagonal is a pentagon hexagon heptagon octagon so polygon with nine diagonal its answer is hexagon so how we will call the uh, sorry how we will uh, find the number of diagonals in a polygon so we can apply the equation n into n minus 3 by 2 okay so here is our answer is hexagon for hexagon the number of sides is uh, how many sorry number of vertex is hexagon 6 vertex right so 6 into 6 minus 3 by 2 so we got the answer as 9 so for hexagon 9 diagonal is there so how many diagonal for pentagon for pentagon 5 diagonal for heptagon 14 diagonal okay and octagon 20 diagonal so we can use the equation for finding the number of diagonal in a polygon is n into n minus 3 by 2 n into n minus 3 by 2 moving to the next one the set of natural numbers is closed under addition and multiplication addition and subtraction addition and division multiplication and subtraction the set of natural numbers we know that it's surely closed under addition and multiplication right set of natural numbers is closed under addition and multiplication so this much only the questions now i am giving some books by famous mathematicians okay okay the man who knew infinity written by robert kanigal okay in the last video we discussed the same thing the man who infinity a movie based on who's life okay life story of genius ramanujan so the ramanujan story this book written by robert kanigal and we know that this next one the very important the elements uh, by euclid okay elements written by euclid and the story of numbers by eli mayo and aryabhatiya by aryabhata okay aryabhatiya by aryabhata 
Now we know that this one Shagundala Devi human computer, she wrote so many books, Th these are the some uh, some of her books okay book of numbers figuring the joy of numbers in the wonderland of numbers perfect murder the world of homosexuals mathability these are the important textbooks books by shagundala devis okay i will read one more time book of numbers figuring the joy of numbers in the wonderland of numbers perfect murder the world of homosexuals mathability are the important books by shagundala devi okay so hope you understood today's video thank you for watching please subscribe my channel for future videos